Hey guys, how's it going? This is Deadly. So today I'm making a quick tutorial video for everybody who uses Twitch, who broadcasts on the website and then also does YouTube. Uh, this video is going to be for showing you guys how to download your video highlights and get it into a file um, that you can actually use on programs like Sony Vegas. One of the issues um, that is with downloading highlights straight from either the website or using third party programs is it downloads it in a file format that you really can't use for editing and that's a problem especially if you do YouTube like me. There's two things like that I think about it like if you just export a highlight from Twitch you just don't get that video quality you can't put intros outros you can't put music behind it you can't edit the clips very well you can only export it and put it on your channel and that works I do it sometimes only for clips that are really entertaining um, or if I'm in a pinch but if you go on my channel, you'll see that the videos that are highlighted and just uploaded compared to the videos that are edited or highlighted, downloaded, and then edited and then uploaded, the difference is massive. So I'm making this tutorial video because I did not find a single video on YouTube that was actually helpful um, when it comes to actually working out the conversion as well. So today I'm just going to be showing you guys that. So you upload and you stream to Twitch. That's fantastic. So you want to find something. Uh, you know from your channel uh, to highlight and it can be anything you know you want to go back to your previous broadcasts um, I'm for the sake of you know tutorial reasons I won't make a highlight here you guys should know how to do it you go to one of your previous highlights uh, you just click on highlight here and then you can basically use the highlight editor which is very useful to uh, make a small little highlight right so let's see if we can do something here all right, so let's say I want to make this into a highlight, and uh, you know, type the title in, etc., etc. You know, you would just create the highlight. Bam. So now you have your highlight. You can visit the highlight here. It can be whatever you want to do. It can be a segment of video. I recommend doing it for maybe 10 minutes, 15 minutes maximum. And if you want to like highlight more than that. Do it in parts. The reason why is is the is using conversion software. Now there is thousands upon thousands upon thousands of com different conversion files online, different programs that are going to say, "Hey, convert it to FLV to WMV," which is kind of the file which, if you download a Twitch uh, highlight directly from. Uh, using a third-party software, it's not going to download it in a file that you can work with. It's going to download it in FLV. Um, and that kind of sucks because for people like me, like I mentioned earlier, you want to edit the, f the software, right? So you're going to need to use a, a program. And most of these programs, I'm just going to be completely honest with you, unless you do some really deep searching and you find a good product, the conversion is going to be very bad. Um, you're going to lose a lot of quality, especially if you're Twitch, Twitch highlights are already not going to be as good as actually recording the footage on your desktop. Um, and that's the reason is because you're streaming it, there's different bit rates that come into it, you lose a lot of quality. So to convert a file, you're going to lose even more quality. So I've tried so many programs, which a lot of them contain malware and spyware, so that's number one. It's going to get you in some trouble. A lot of them are just flat out viruses. Uh, which is another issue so it's really hard to find a program that works but what I have found that works 100% of the time with lossless quality uh, is onlineconvert.com and honestly onlineconvert.com is such a really easy I don't, I'm not being paid for by them or anything this is a really good website like I'm not doing a shameless advertisement here but this is a legitimate really awesome website for everything for conversion like video audio imagery imagery with essentially lossless conversion um, which is what we need to make clips for you guys that are sexy enough to upload right so once you have your your highlight created right you can go to the link you can see and this is the clip we made for tutorial um, very bad clip obviously because I was killed um, but all you want to do is you want to go and download this as FLV. So there's a website here, nightdev.com. Nightdev is one of the best developers for uh, different projects for Twitch. You have Nightbot, of course, Better TV, uh, Stream Tip, 
and obviously Twitch down. You also have some different projects which I use and other people use, which is the follow alert feature. Uh, you have subscription chats and all these different really cool things that as a streamer you should use, especially if you're you know don't have that many mods, Nightbot for follow alert. And when you're when you're starting fresh, follow alert is probably one of the most important things that you can have. Um, and for me, I just got my subscription button this week, so subscriber alert's really good. But for the sake of downloading, you want to go to Twitch Down, and you'll come to this page. It's very simple. You just select Highlight, um, and I'm doing this as we as we see right here. As you can see, uh, I have videos coming up right now. So you want to submit your highlight that you just made, and you click Submit, and it's going to start downloading that video, more or less. And uh, this doesn't take actually too long. It's pretty quick. Now, once you actually download this file, um, that's when we take it to online convert. There we go. Download it. You'll start downloading it as a FLV video file. Now, for the sake of videos, I already have a bunch of different highlights ready to go. So I'm going to come back to online convert here now that I have my FLV file. And you're going to want to go to video converter. And personally, I use WMV. But if you do MP4 or MPEG2, uh, really whatever video file format that you use to edit, you can choose it here, and it's essentially almost lossless. Um, so I'm going to go to WMV. I'm going to choose a video that I'm going to want to do. So I'm making upcoming hacker video, um, a, you know, kind of showcasing it and showing, hey, hacking's a problem. You guys uh, are probably noticing that in Daisy, it is a huge issue. Um, so we're going to do Hacker Interrupts Viewer Event. And I'm just going to click Convert. I'm not even going to mess around with any of this stuff. And it's going to start downloading your file. Once your file has been completed, it's going to say, hey, your file is finished. It will automatically start downloading it to your Downloads folder, which is right here. Um, and it's at a decent file size, 413 megabits for about 15 minutes of, of video, which is nice. It's really good. And this is going to download this clip so you can edit it with programs like Sony Vegas, for example, which is what I personally use to make my videos. So I can, with an FLV file, typically, let me get this showing here. Typically, with an FLV file, rink, rink, it's going to try to do it and it's going to be like, what the fuck are you doing? I can't, I can't use this video. I just can't do it. So that's why you're going to have to convert it to a file size that works for your video editor. Hey, if you have a video editor that works with FLV, great, but I'm sure a lot of people don't. And um, for me anyway, I personally use Sony Vegas and uh, that's what really works for me. So once the video gets completed, you just drag it in like you normally would with any type of, um, any type of WMV format video and you're good to go. You're ready to ready to roll. You're ready to edit it, make it a sexy video, add some cool intros to it, maybe some outros. You know what I mean? So you can do all the stuff that you normally would with recorded software, and the quality is pretty good. As you can see in the top right, you know it can get a little grainy sometimes. Keep in mind that I downloaded this particular clip from YouTube, so this has been up uploaded with Twitch, created into a highlight, downloaded as FLV, converted into a WMV, and then upload it to YouTube and then download it from YouTube. So this particular file is pretty low quality, but I think you guys understand the process. So um, the only other thing that I would like to say is if you want to do the videos longer than five minutes, highlights longer than five minutes, you are going to need uh, to get a package. You're going to have to buy um, a bigger uh, package with online converter. Honestly, it's worth the money. It really is worth the money for me. Um, it costs maybe it's a couple. It's a couple bucks a month, um, and it allows me to convert files up to 400 megabytes. So you're probably going to need to upgrade your online converter package account uh, if you want to do videos longer than five minutes. But like I said, if you're trying to find a converter that literally covers every fucking thing on the internet, I'm telling you every single thing, this is kind of the website I use and it works really, really well with what I do. So anyways, guys, I hope you found that helpful. Um, it's definitely the best strategy that I've personally found uh, for downloading and editing Twitch highlights. So if you guys have better methods, 
Leave them in the comment section below. I'd love to read them. And if you found this video helpful, definitely leave a like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, also, you know, check me out every day on Twitch. I'm there making videos, uploading it, playing DayZ and Breaking Point and Armor 3. So if you guys are in the Twitch community, definitely stop by and say hi. All right, guys, have a good evening. And I'll talk to you later. Okay, guys, really quick before we end the video, there is a secondary method, which I kind of just remembered while I'm putting this together. And you can upload your highlights and export them directly to YouTube. And once they're on as a private video, you can just go and download it as MP4. The only thing about this is you're limited to how many downloads you can do per day. Uh, so if you're highlighting a couple clips together at once and you, you have to wait for them to upload to YouTube, which is going to take away the quality of your video significantly. So keep that in mind, which online convert doesn't, it doesn't take away as much quality. So when you upload it from Twitch, put it on YouTube and then download it. Um, there is some, con there is some quality loss, but it is pretty fast. Um, so this is a secondary method for everybody who is looking for, Hey, if I can't really afford a decent online converter package. This is probably the next best thing to do. Um, but again, you're not gonna get that quality like you would get um, from doing the method that I just described. So anyways, guys, have a good night and I'll talk to you.